we'll do our runner's lunge towards the wall. And we'll tap the right knee. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And sit all the way back. Up the right foot and bend over the left leg. Elbows down to the mat. Two and 
one of our best things. Now when I'm done with the plate, is called a high pull. So you want to keep your legs straight and we're going to make this a balance exercise by coming off of your toes. So this is how it goes. You want to hold the plate like this, come down to your shins and pull it up to your chin. So shin to chin and the elbows go up and out. So let's try 16 of those. So it's down, lift, down to the chin, up to the chin, and flare out your elbows. 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, Eight, 
seven, six, five, four, three, two, all right, let's take a little break. All right, stretch it out. Now, the next set, we're going to use that plate again. Actually, let's do something else, and then we'll come back to the plate about that. All right, so let's get down to the mat. Because we are so not done. All right, half of the stretch. Half the breath. All right, let's give our shoulders a rest. So today we're going to do four exercises for your glutes, four on each side. We're going to start with our firefighter lift. Then you're going to take the leg way up like this and flex the foot. Bring it over the right leg and stamp your heel against an imaginary wall just like that. Then we're going to take the leg out. We're going to do two sets of circles, 16 one way, 16 the other way, and then that leg is going to go down and up. All right, quadruple threads. So let's start with our stretch. And if your wrist starts to hurt, you can always come down to your elbows. Let's start with 16 fire high lifts all the way. 16. 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, flex your foot, bring it over the right leg, stamp that wall, and push, 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 push. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 2 sets of circles, straighten the leg, turn it, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, reverse it, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, one more exercise, leg lift, down and up, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's take a child's pose, and we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So, quadruped position or crouch position, either way is fine. All right, let's lift the right leg. Here we go. It's 16, 15. 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, flex your foot, stamp the wall, 16, 15, 14, 13, push, 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 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, now straight leg, we're going to turn it, 60, 50, 40, 30, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, to reverse it, 60, 50, 40, 30, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Last exercise. Get that leg down. 
a plank. Here we go. 60, 50, 40, 30, 12, 11, 10, 9, and our last eight, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Let's take our child's pose. And we're going to stand up and grab that plate. Now, normally I have this unwritten rule that once we're down on the back, we're going to stand up. And I'm going to break the rule today because it's plate day. So when I say, yeah. I mean, what are rules if you don't break? Right? All right, so now it's going to be same size. So right hand to right foot, and then we'll do our high pulls. So hold the plate like this. It's got a little handle there. And here we go. Find your spot on the floor. Down, two, up, take two, down, two, up, two, down, two, up, two, down. Two, four more on this side. Four. Slow and steady. Three. Don't rush. Two. And one. All right, let's switch sides. Now the left side. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four, three, two, or one more time on each side. Back to the right side. Eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. Back to the left side for the very last time. Eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, we're going to go right to our high poles. Two more. One more. All right, grab the plate with both hands. Let's finish strong. Down, two, lift, two, down, two, lift, two, down, two, lift, two, down, two. Here's our last 12. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, and one. All right, nicely done. Let's come down to that, and we're going to do it on our left side. So let's do a child's pose first.
weights and joints. It's a matter of biomechanics. So we've got this five pound plate. If you bring the weight closer to the joint, which in this case is your hip joint, this is the easiest. The, the farther away from the joint that weight goes, the harder it is. So if you imagine this weight, I can't get it down to my ankle, but if you can imagine a five pound weight on your ankle, to lift it would be much harder than closer to the joint. So I'm telling you that because you can adjust this to your own level. So if this is hard for you, you bring the plate up to the hip joint. This is the easiest way to go. That weight is easy to manage. If the weight is manageable or it feels light, then bring it down closer to the knee and you'll start to feel that weight a little bit more intensely. So we're going to do 16 lifts like this, holding the plate, if you can, at arm's distance, and then we're going to tap, 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 leaving the plate on the leg. All right, let's begin this. So lift, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, and try holding the plate as close to your knee as you can for the maximum amount of tension. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, now flex your foot, tap your heels. Tap, 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 tap. 12, 11, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Let's do it again. Point the toe, lift the leg. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, and 1 final set of heel taps. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, last 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, oh my goodness, that's oh. great, oh uh, yeah, it's funny how heavy that 5 pounds, uh, I know you picked up the plate, you said, oh, I can do 10 pounds here, well aren't you glad you did all right, let's lift the leg, little ankle circles, and hold the heel to the floor. All right, let's roll over onto our right side. Now, same deal. Stretch out your arm. Let's get that plate close to the knee, point your toes. All right, let's begin. 16. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, tap your heels together. Yeah. 
beautiful. Oh, you, what did you say, your saddlebags? Yeah, I can feel that that will help the <laughs> And it's really, really good for your IT band as well. Pull your heel to your feet. All right, let's do our downward dog exercise. So we're going to do our tapas first. And we're not going to use the plate for this. This is just going to be body weight. So slide up to your down the dog. Oh, that stretch out. That is so amazing. Up the heels, up and down. Now we're going to get those heels flat, flat, flat. And here's next to your arms. Let's hold it for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, relax everybody. Here's your exercise. Walk your hands in. In the advanced option, we're going to be on our right foot with the leg straight. We're going to tap to the rear, tap to the side, tap to the rear. And you're going to swing that leg up and out. So down right here at 9 o'clock, lift it up, tap at 6 o'clock. Nine o'clock, six o'clock. Modification, of course, you know this. On your hands or on your elbows, nine o'clock, six o'clock. And let's start from the top of our stretch. Child pose. And into your downward dog. Take a minute, let's flash those heels up and down. Make sure our posterior chain is stretched and now flat your heels on the mat. Walk your hands in, lift the left leg, and away we go. Now to the left, down to the side, down to the rear, down to the side, down to the rear, down to the side, down to the rear. Nine o'clock. Six o'clock, twelve, to the rear, eleven, to the rear, ten, to the rear, nine, to the rear, eight, to the rear, seven, to the rear, six, to the rear, five, to the rear, Four, rear, three, two, and one. Beautiful, beautiful, and stretch. Right, let's do the same thing on the other side. Stretch it out, and then up into your downward dog. Stretch, walk your hands in, left foot in the center. All right, now with the right, it's down to the side, down to the rear, down to the side, down to the rear. Three o'clock, six o'clock, three o'clock, let's count to 12. 12. Rear, 11, to the rear, 10, to the rear, 9, last 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, and one. And our stretch. Oh yeah. Now let's 
roll back onto our left side. No play this time. And we're working the hip a little bit. So you're going to relax on your left side. And today, you all right? Yeah, I you know, Lorraine and I was wondering if that was great. I didn't realize it was a vacuum. No, they always vacuum right when we're having class. Just in case you haven't noticed. I brought my umbrella so it wouldn't work. <laughs> Unbelievable. All right, so we're going to take a right leg. You want to tap to the front, lift, tap to the rear, and lift. To really get that joint in hip top shape. And then we'll do our little tap, 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 which is our active rest, in case you're wondering, to keep the tension on the leg and then do a second step. All right, let's start to the front. So tap to the front. Tap to the rear. Tap to the front. Now the toe is pointed and the leg is straight. To the rear. Front. Lift. Rear. Lift. Twelve. Lift. Rear. Lift. Eleven. Lift. Rear. Lift. Ten. Lift. Rear. Lift. Nine. Lift. Rear. Lift. Eight. To rear, seven, to rear, six, to rear, five, to rear, four, to rear, and three, to rear, two, come on, let's get that leg way up there, and one. All right, tap, tap, tap your heels. And 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, we will do second set, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, now start to the front, front, lift to the rear, front, lift to the rear, and front, lift to the rear, come on, remember straight, straight leg, all right, here's our last day. Eight, to the rear. Seven, lift to the rear. Six, lift to the rear. Five, lift to the rear. Four, lift to the rear. Three, lift to the rear. Two, and one. Here's our last set of heel tasks. And tap. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and take your right knee and pull it up to your chest because of stretching that leg. And on the little circles here. Pull your heel to glue. Let's roll over on the right side. Woo! Everybody okay? You know, when, when you need when you need a car, where's Molly? I mean, yeah, she's <laughs> kind of, it's my favorite grunter. Yeah, she's, my, she's my favorite person because you always know how Molly feels. Yeah. You know, she, she lets it all out there. I truly I truly love that. So when I ask myself, are people feeling this? Yeah. I always have Molly there to answer the questions. All right, let's begin. Front, lift to the rear. Front, lift to the rear. Front, lift to the rear. All right, this is 13. Lift to the rear. 12, to the rear. 11. Rear, 10, 9, 8, lift to the rear, 7, lift to the rear, 6, lift to the rear, 5, 
four, three, two. Here's our first set of tiny heel taps. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. Let's do last set of 12. Front, lift to the rear. 11, lift to the rear. 10, lift to the rear. 9, lift to the rear. 8, lift to the rear. 7, lift to the rear. 6, lift to the rear. 5, lift to the rear. And 4, 3, 2, and 1. And our last set of heel taps. 6, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and pull your left knee up to your chest. And then we're going to take our leg, we're going to go back to circles. And the heel to the glute. And now we're on our backs. So I thought it would be nice to do rock the cradle here. Kind of loosen up. So if you're unfamiliar with the name of this exercise, I'm sure you know this. We've done this many times. You're going to be in a bridge position and you're just going to take your hips and swing them side to side like a cradle. And then we're going to push first on the right side, pushes on the right, pushes on the left. And we'll swing side to side. All right, so let's begin with swinging side to side. Doesn't matter which side goes first. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, now push 16 times on the right side only. And it's 16, 15, 14, 13, push, push, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, and push on the left. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, now side to side, and then 60, 50, side to side, side to side, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, our final four. Three, two, and one. And let's relax. Take your knees to the left. We're going to do a hip roll. Arms to the right and relax your body. And let's get those knees all the way down to the floor. And the same thing on the other side. Knees tracking down to the floor on the right side. Arms to the left. All right, let's take our plate. Now we're gonna hold the plate parallel to the floor, like this. And we're gonna do windshield wipers with the plate, and we'll do one side at a time. So again, if you're imagining a clock, your toes are pointing to 12 o'clock, the plate is pointing to 12 o'clock. The plate is going to go down to 3 o'clock. Your legs are going to go to 9 o'clock. And then back up to 12. 
So we'll do 16 this way. Then you'll switch the plate to your left hand and we'll do the same thing on the other side. All right, here we go. Down, two, up, two. Down to nine o'clock, up to 12. Nine to three, back to 12. Nine to three, back to 12. 12, and lift. 11, and lift. 10, lift. Nine, lift. Eight, lift. Seven, lift. Six, five, four, three, two, switch sides. Other side. Down and lift. Down and lift. Now the legs are going to three o'clock, late to nine o'clock. Thirteen. Twelve. Eleven. Lift. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Right down, it's time for our spinach. Oh, that was a good workout. Five pounds only, imagine that. Yeah, and it's very rare that we use um, something besides our body weight, right? But when we do, it really pays off. So let's start with our right leg crossing, the right ankle crossing over our left knee and pull the left leg towards your chest. And let's get our hip flexors. Stretch out, starting on the left side. Then let's do the same thing on the right leg. Just cross the left ankle over the right knee and pull the right leg towards your chest. And let's just cross our legs into our pretzel. Put a hand in the opposite foot and squeeze. And of course, our happy boy. And place your hands on your ankles. We're going to tap our toes. And extend the legs. Tap and extend. The knees together, we're going to roll ourselves up. Roll your shoulders and round your back. Tuck your chin and place your fingertips on your chest. And there's our flies for this dirty day, another dirty day. So, hope you will have. Sunshine and cooler temperatures next week, and I will see you on Tuesday at 9 30. Thank you. By the way, please don't forget that we have a YouTube channel. If you go to YouTube and you put in my name, Ellen Gordon, comes up all of these nice uh, routines that Lorraine has been recording. And my husband told me yesterday that we had 963 views. Can you believe that? Yes. That's awesome, right? Yes. All right, so check it out. If you can't get to the gym, I will see you live next week in person. Ellen Gordon.